If you don't like the raw dish, this recipe is definitely not for you. So you just have to click on unskip, okay? Hello beautiful people! Today's recipe is a steak tartare. Guys, you definitely need to buy your meat from a reputable store. For this recipe, I'm gonna use tenderloin. Why I'm gonna use tenderloin? Tenderloin is very lean, it's very tender, it doesn't have any marble. You need to ensure there's no silver skin at all. First of all, we're gonna start by dicing the tenderloin, as you can see in the video. So be careful, they need to be very small and diced properly. Second, we're gonna dice the onions. We're gonna chop them very fine. I don't need really to explain. I'm sure you guys know how to cut an onion. No? We're gonna bring a ball, add some crushed ice, then we're gonna add another ball on the top, and then we're gonna work with the steak tartare, okay? Because we want it to stay cold and fresh. Now, we're gonna add the chopped onions, chopped jerkins, chopped capers. Chopped chives as well. On the top, we can add some flour de sel. I love flour de sel, it has really good flavor, okay? Then we're gonna add some olive oil. We're gonna mix them all together. And it's done. And like, if you want, you can add some Worcestershire sauce as well. These people who like it, but me, honestly, I don't like it. Now, for the plating, I'm gonna make it very sexy and very easy. In a white dish, we're gonna add the moutarde de Dijon. We're gonna spread it with a spatula. We're gonna add the cylinder on the top. Again, we're gonna add the steak tartare. We're gonna remove it. Quail egg. A toss on the side. We're gonna add the sakura cress. How does a steak tartare taste like? It doesn't really taste bloody because you know it's raw meat, so you think it's gonna taste bloody. It doesn't taste bloody at all. In my opinion, if the beef is cooked, the flavor is very strong. When you eat it raw, the flavor is very light. It's so well seasoned, you know, because it's well prepared. It has vegetables inside, it the mustard and everything. You don't really feel the meat that bothers you. You know, like the idea of having raw meat. It's perfectly balanced. Even when you eat it, it it's not like chewy, you know? It doesn't like, you know, because you have always the idea of eating raw meat. So it doesn't really seem like raw meat. It's really fresh for summer and you definitely need to try this stage. YouTubers, I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you very much for watching. A très bientôt. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, see you very soon.